everyone welcome back to my channel so in today's video i am going to do a huge wardrobe declutter i'm really trying to create a capsule wardrobe and now that i've moved down to brighton and i have got my styling guru this Hello. is lena um so lena like literally is the person that i always turn to when it comes to fashion advice whenever i see something that i like i will send her a picture of it and i'll say yes no or maybe and she is one of the most honest people I've ever come across in my life. I will link her Instagram down below um, because if you ever need some advice, then just send her a message and she's really good with that kind of stuff. Um, so we're going to go through my wardrobe here and decide what we're keeping, what we're getting rid of, and what items that I need to buy to make my wardrobe work a little bit better. So for example, this is what she made me buy yesterday. I absolutely love it. It's um, from Tesco's, from uh, yeah, F&F, &F, and I just think it's so nice. It's this really nice gold big buttons, and it feels like such good quality. Um, it was 16 pounds, I don't know if I just said that, but yeah, I just feel like today, I've had quite a few compliments as well. Like someone said, it looks like I've lost weight. Um, and I actually just think it's because I am wearing clothes that maybe suit my figure a little bit better. So I'm gonna take you over to my wardrobe, show you what's in there, and then we're going to have like a massive try on session, a get rid session, and then we're gonna brainstorm what we need to go shopping for as well. So. Ready, Leans? Yes, come on, let's, let's do, it. do it. Okay, so here is my wardrobe at the moment. These are my tops. These are my bottoms. I've got some like trousers and then also some shorts and skirts and stuff. And then over here I have got jumpers, shirts, and then dresses over here as well. Also, Lena and I went and had our colors done a little while ago. So she has just found my color swatch here. So we're going to be working with this because all of these colors in here, especially the ones that I have starred, double star is like they really suit me, single star is they suit me more, um, you know, and all these different things. So we're gonna be working with this color palette here, and then we're gonna take it to my wardrobe, work our way through it, get rid of anything that just is a no-no. Here is my get rid pile. It's actually quite a lot of stuff. And I didn't actually do this to my wardrobe that long ago. So I need to fold these up a lot neater, but these are my trousers and skirts and shorts. These are my basic tees, like um, kind of like my vest tops and things like that for layering. And then these are all the bits that I am keeping. So I have hung up quite a few of my t-shirts here instead of um, Marie Kondo folding them here. So I've got jumper dress, jumpers, um, shirts, and then I've got all my t-shirts and bits, and then some strappy tops. And then over here is like my dresses, and I've got sort of like summer dresses and kind of ones that I can wear during the winter as well with tights. So yeah, and now I'm gonna show you a couple of bits that we've just um, come back from town today in Brighton. So I wanna show you a couple of bits that we have just bought. Right, so we went to H&M earlier and I bought this little like t-shirt, this was 9 99 and I think it's like my color, but it goes really, really well with so many different outfits. And then I also bought these paper bag trousers. Let me just, my filming 
situation is not the best. So because I've got a smaller waist, Lena says that I need to wear trousers that come higher on my waist, because usually I wear jeans that come to about here, and then obviously I'm highlighting almost my biggest um, part of my body. So I got these paper bag trousers. They were $25.99 and again from H&M. I'll link everything down below that I'm mentioning in this video. Um, and they are really nice and loose fitting, so they're very comfortable. They're not like wearing a jean that kind of is a bit restricting. And together, I think this outfit goes really well. This is the reality of filming when you have kids. <laughs> right so one last item that i got with lena were these paper bag trousers as well um as you can see i'm gonna be wearing a lot of paper bag trousers because i just think it's what my figure needs so these ones are kind of like um uh pleather trousers they're from um tesco the fnf collection and they come with this really nice like kind of goldy belt up here and then they are bigger on the leg obviously and then taper in as you go down so once again they're just really flattering and with some heels to go out or with some white trainers during the day they're really really versatile to wear so yeah really pleased them these were 20 pounds perfect right I am back <laughs> It's now night time and the kids came home from school. Lena and I tried to carry on filming, but they just kept making loads and loads of noise. So it just wasn't possible. We had to like feed them, water them, and now they're in bed. So anyway, Lena has written down a whole kind of big piece of paper telling me exactly what I need to buy to make my wardrobe more capsule. And also she wanted to write some stuff down um, that she thinks should be in everyone's wardrobe. I feel a lot more cleansed after getting rid of some of those things. Sometimes I hold on to things because I think, oh, maybe I'll lose a bit of weight to fit back into that, or maybe I'll like that again, maybe that'll come back into fashion. But in truth, so many of the items that are in my wardrobe I haven't worn for a very, very long time. So Lena just pushes me into going, okay, fine, get rid of it, you know? And I know the things that I have got rid of, I'm not going to miss, so. Basically, um, I've got two more items that I want to show you that um, I have bought with Lena, which I really love. They are two jackets. One's like a smartish winter coat and one is a leather jacket that I found in um, TK Maxx today. I'm so excited to show it to you. Um, so basically, this is what Lena says you should have in your capsule wardrobe. So you should always have a leather jacket. Um, you should also, when it comes to jackets, have a denim jacket, a raincoat or a parka and also a blazer. So she thinks you should have a black blazer and a kind of like caramelly color blazer but that is also because those are my colors so if you guys have different colors that you think suit you better then always go for colors that you know make your face pop so when i went and had my colors then i really do feel like i can tell when i put a color on that drains me or a color that kind of brings me back to life if that makes any sense at all um so you need to get your little black dress it doesn't literally have to be a little black dress it's basically just a dress that you feel great in you can wear it day night you can dress it up down um you know it could actually be a purple dress or a red dress or something like that but basically it's kind of like your staple dress that's in your wardrobe that you can wear so many different ways i have quite a few different like evening outfits that i just wear so rarely that I feel like I almost need to invest in pieces that I can um, have dual purpose for, so a nighttime and a daytime outfit rolled into one. She says she should always have some black and beige pointy shoes because they go with everything, obviously. As I'm getting older, I feel like I can't have a high heel anymore, so I kind of look for things about um, that high in heel. You can have like a statement heel as well some perfect fit jeans the jeans i've got on today are the ivy range 19 pounds 50 i think or yeah 19 pounds 50 um for these jeans and they fit so nicely they are so comfortable i'll link them down below um and i have got them in quite a few different colors they have like a dark wash a black wash so yeah they've got loads of different washes and i know i can just go in there pick up a size 10 and it'll fit me really nicely um she thinks a striped cotton long arm jersey top just goes with everything and also you can um you can layer it up and things like that so your forever bag your bag that if you're if in doubt you think oh what bag's going to go with this outfit 
this bag will go with it. So I've got a mulberry little kind of black over the shoulder bag um, that I use and I, I know it will just go with every single outfit that I ever wear. So it's like an investment bag, but one that you're never going to get rid of because it's just a keeper, goes with everything, perfect in your wardrobe. You need some casual white and black t-shirts like I find just I think H&M just do a basic range where they just some v-neck t-shirts I've got a white one so far so I do need to get a black one that you can also layer up go really nicely under coats or leather jackets with a scarf and things like that um, white blouse that's a must so I thought I had one um, but I never felt that great in it whereas like with this one this isn't white obviously this is like a caramel color but I just feel great in this I feel like it's um it doesn't hug me it's um, really relaxed and loose and it's kind of like a thickish material so I don't feel like it clings to me as well so I have decided this is what I need to look for but in a white version so white blouse you can again dress it up down day night attire just works really well all the time um, you need layering tops like nude and neutral layering tops um, especially now coming into autumn and winter we want to start layering ourselves up um, so if you're wearing a big thick chunky knit or something you might not want a like a t-shirt or a long sleeve top under there because it's not that cold enough for that so you'll just want like a little strappy top or something like that um so she's put a cashmere sweater in a neutral color that will kind of go with everything you need some oversized sweaters as well black and brown leather boots i think that's pretty essential because black and brown boots will go with any outfit whatsoever this is not going to be a shopping list I'm going out to buy like tomorrow. This is gonna be a very slow process um, and I want them to be the right pieces because I want to invest in my wardrobe so that um, next autumn winter I don't have to rebuy what I'm buying now. I want things that will last me a while. The coats I'm gonna show you in a minute were, weren't cheap um, but they are going to last. Um, and last of all, she says you need some ankle boots and some white trainers as well. White trainers are pretty essential, I feel, because, um, for example, with these paper bag trousers, I can wear a heel with them, dress them up in the evening, or I can wear a flat white trainer in the daytime and I can do the school run on them. So, um, yeah, I just feel like that's definitely the way you need to go. So now what I'm going to do is show you these two coats I bought and that's going to be the end of my video so thank you so much for watching guys i hope you enjoyed it and i will do an updated autumn capsule wardrobe very soon once i have gone shopping for a couple of these items bye guys right pretty pleased with this purchase today this is from this is a tk max gold label item this should have been 840 pounds oh was 120 pounds but look at this leather jacket like I have wanted a leather jacket that's like this for so long and I absolutely love this one I think it is so nice it's a size 8 and I think it's very generous for a size 8 but I'm absolutely loving it so I did have to think quite hard about this purchase but I honestly have wanted a leather jacket like this for so long so I just think it goes really really well and because it's quite a generous fit, I feel like I can wear jumpers underneath it and I'm going to wear it all the time. This is from H&M. This was £80. Again, it's a size 8 and I, again, I think it's quite a generous fit. But look how nice it is. So again, I can wear like chunky knits underneath, something like that. So it goes down just past my knees and it's got this nice neckline you can wear a nice scarf with it and yeah just does it really nicely it actually comes with pockets here but i haven't un um like i haven't opened them up yet so i just think this is such a lovely coat and then you can wear it open as well like this like how nice is that nice huh